Alright, yeah, welcome back to some more Two Point Hospital. So, I was actually rummaging around while the game was paused just before I started the recording because I knew that there was a way of um, assigning certain doctors, and I'll pause for now just to show that off. Assigning certain doctors to do specific jobs, so like my diagnosis doctor here, uh, you can actually assign jobs down this way. And you can tell him that he can work in the GP's office, the psychiatrist, stuff like that. So as long as he's um, qualified to do it, you can tell him to do certain things. Now, I think what I want to do is get somebody like Leonard Barnacle to be purely GP. And then what I could do with Leonard Barnacle is I could then go train. And I want to train him in... Let's see, general practice, so which upgrades his general practice skill. Actually, I could do that with a student doctor here as well. Get him in and get a student, uh, a trainee on that one. And then once he's done, then we've got ourselves a GP who's actually qualified to do his job. Which is cool, right? So let's start that training. Let's unpause and let's continue as though I never paused the game or anything like that. So... We are on the job of making chromotherapy a thing. Also, actually, now that I remembered, there's pay reviews here. And it looks like Kelly Rubbish is uh, in need of a pay rise. Nope, not happy. I thought that's what that meant. How about if I go... Boop. Nope, you're just getting paid substantial amounts of money for no reason. All right, then. Why are you unhappy then? Thirsty and hungry. Well, you could go and take a break. How does that sound? Yeah. We might have too many generators. Several of them are idle. That is fine, because once we expand, that will definitely need to be something that we have. Um, we received a gift from Holistics courtesy of Augustus Lavender. It was a bit suspicious, so I sent it to the lab. Apparently, it's what's known as a homeopathic poison. It's entirely safe to drink and actually quite tasty. He must really hate us. So he impressed the VIP and he gave us 15 reputation. Nice. So, reputation's over half now. I don't know if that means it's full or if it's going to the next level. I think it means it's almost full. But we're actually level 6 as well and hospital level. Pretty cool. Alright, trying a doctor and research. Oh yes, we do need a research department. So, I'm going to buy one of these plots, I think. Okay, so we don't actually have the deluxe clinic. Ooh, award season. Let's do it. I think we've already killed a guy, unfortunately. But it wasn't really our fault. It's very difficult not to get that no deaths thing. Let's just open them all. Yeah, it's not bad for a first, uh, first award season. Best research hospital. Obviously, we haven't done any research. Hospital of the year. The winningest hospital of the year because they need more awards. <laughs> I guess this is the award for the most awards. Maybe. That'd be interesting. So we got 37. The thing is, with 37,000, we can't actually buy the research room as well. We might have to take out a loan for that. But before then, I think I need a deluxe clinic. Oh no, we've got one here, haven't we? Yeah, that is literally a deluxe clinic. Alright. I almost built it right next to it. There is something we need though, right? Psychiatry we don't have, Pan's lab we don't have, but we don't have any Pan's lab patients. Not sure if I have any psychiatry patients, but it's not really told me I'm lacking them just yet. We definitely don't have any clowns in the hospital, so... I think we are fully equipped for what we have at the moment. Our toilets are doing very nicely, we've got just the right amount there. We've got training going on, which is very nice. Apparently we've got too many janitors, which is always a pleasure to hear. Yeah, we're doing doing really good. So let's just do some staff assignments, I guess. Let's uh, have a look at our nurses. Uh, you should be 
working in the pharmacy. Nigella. That's going to be your job. Hmm. And then you can work in everything else. And you can work in everything in total because we don't have enough nurses, I guess. Ooh, we got uh, some awards for training some staff. Nice. Oh, we're slow on the cure 10 patients. Come on, four more. You know we can do it. The problem is that we've got these, like, chroma patients here. We know that we're not going to be able to cure them. I've got a scarf and a hat on. Is it that cold? <laughs> Let me just check on that one. Temperature. That no, seems fine. Nothing like a burp. And now, yeah, we need more drinks machines. Comes in three new flavors. With I can't build it there. Open your mouth and have a burp. Hours Seriously, why can't I build it there? This is two, two, two point I can't seem to build it at all, actually. Hang on. What is wrong? Maybe it's a bug. Let me just jump out of that menu, go into a new one. 87% sure of the diagnosis. Uh, it could be that chroma patient. Yeah, let's try it. Let's try it. Ooh, mucky feet is a new illness we found. Feet so grubby that the filth will never come out. Spreads germs like wildfire. We'll send the patient for treatment in our ward. Okay. Ooh, we've actually got an upgrade on the drug mixer. Let's get that in there. We're up to about 61,000 now, so we're closing in on the point now where... To drug mixer. I don't know why I can't build these drinks machines. I really don't. Hmm. Can I build anything? No. Why can't I build anything? Well, I'm gonna build this. I can build it in here. Is this area full? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Is there such a thing? Oh, you were the 87, weren't you? We killed him by trying to remove his head. Oh boy. Don't be a ghost. Don't be a ghost. Don't be a ghost. Oh god. Alright, training time. We need ghost capture being trained to our janitors. Because I know we don't have any. Potty mouth discovered. When a patient opens their mouth, terrible things happen caused by drinking water from a toilet sink or a toilet. That's why we have the water fountain. Yeah, you're going to be around for quite some time, unfortunately. Failed treatment for lightheadedness. Yeah. That's what we get for trying to remove your head. Okay, so finances. I would like a loan, please. Here you can view loan offers from a range of companies. Take loans out and repay existing loans. Each loan company offers a different amount of money within with a monthly repayment based on the repayment period and interest rate. Some loan offers will only become available once the hospital meets a certain criteria. You can adjust the amount you want to borrow before taking out the loan. Using the slider, once you've taken out a loan, you can repay it at any time as long as you have the money. I think we need about 30,000. We're trying to build... Uh, let's see. Yeah, we're trying to build the research, so we need 35. So yeah, let's just take out a loan of 30. Let's say 35, just so we've got an extra bit. Let's go for the two-point bank. I won't go anywhere near Swindle Insurance. Thank you. Thank you very much. Not happening. Yeah, why can't I? It's bugging me, that. If anyone knows why I can't build in this hospital anymore, I'd be curious to know. Uh-oh, we got a backlog. Alright, well, we do need extra GP's offices, so... Let's get one on the corner here. 
ready to go. You know what? This one's going to trigger some people, right? This one... This one, right? Is to cure OCD. Look at this. Yeah. Oh, no. That can't be right. It's got to go behind there. We want a radiator there. Coffee machine facing the back. <laughs> He's seen what I'm doing here. Oh. Oh, my mouse has died. No. God damn it. That's not why I can't place the drinks machine, but I am a savage for doing what I'm doing right now. There we go. All right, problem solved. There we go, a nice bookshelf. It's a prestige level three room. Let's get a plant there and a plant there. Oh no, that's too, it's too nice. There we go. GP's office. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful. All right, I'm gonna get a, a doctor in here for now. And make sure to get some benches so they're not stood waiting. Alright, research department. It's going to be a nice and big research department because I know that this is kind of the point of the hospital is to get, to get research. Oh, we've got clowns. Oh, no. Means I need a clown clinic. Okay, researcher's desk and a research pod. Seems complicated to use to begin a research project. Alright, we're gonna get you in the corner. And then I suppose we're gonna do like... Something like that. Um, My therapist still says I need to find a hobby. That's so not I right. To try uh, oh, Every there we go. The small knife and a piece of wood. It's Six seems fine. Six experience. seems fine. But how many stakes does one man need? Get a large radiator in here, and then at the back we'll have all of our utilities for our people who should never leave the research department ever. Plant right there. Let's make sure they've got all of their research material, you know. There you go. All the research material you need. And a motivator. Let's get a motivator in there. There we go. Definitely want a load of certificates because we are the greatest. Center of that. This one goes right here. Research monitors, big bins, aircon unit. We don't need aircon. Cupboards, decorative items. Yeah. No, it's bored. Increases hospital attractiveness and room prestige. No, I kind of want... Where's like my bookshelves and things like that? That's what I want to know. Oh, this is going to cost me 87,000. Maintenance announcement. Plants need water. I need a loan. Because I have way overdone this. Unless I go delete, delete, delete. Now I can afford it. And then we'll add to it as we go. Because we do want this to be a big thing. Research project. We want chromotherapy. Start that project. Send home the chromotherapy staff. Uh, patients. Promote you. Send you home. Promote you. We have our ghost capture now, so that ghost should be gone. I also need to train some people now in research. Boom. I need a trainee staff member. We also need some extra doctors as well, so we're gonna have to wait until we've got mm, mock stars. We need psychiatry, we don't have it, so I'm gonna have to reject it. God, look at this room. Look at it. <laughs> I'm a monster. Oh boy. Let's make sure we get some uh, drinks and snacks and things. I want to get it the furthest part. 
Just in case I can get a bench in here, which doesn't look like I can, but I can get a leaflet stand. So I will. About a magazine rack at the other side. I want to keep these guys pretty well occupied while they wait. God, the music's good in this game. Get you in there. Beautiful. Yeah, the problem is that we we don't have clown clinics. We also don't have researchers. Now we're in debt. We have spent a lot of money though, and I plan on investing a lot more in here as well, but... Chromotherapy, go home. Right. Any training courses that I can do without... Having to hire someone would be great. Like you training diagnosis to a lot of staff would be great. Diagnostics, sorry. Which is diagnostic skills. So anyone I want doing diagnosis. I mean, you junior nurses, I've got you pinned in pharmacy and things like that, haven't I? One of you can do it, though. Let's get that sorted, because I do need the money from training, and I also should really be training people at the same time. Is that a general diagnosis backlog? Ah, it's because we've got nobody working in it. Where's our nurse? Let's hire a new one. Beatrice Lips. There we go. It's the only reason we've got a backlog there. Something to be aware of. Staff promotion. Yep, yeah, you get promoted. Feel happy. What are you doing? Waving your thing around. Oh dear. Hmm. I'm almost tempted to just like send you already home because I know I can't treat you and I know I don't plan to either. So it's a complete waste of time for me to do that. And a waste of my staff time as well. <laughs> That's good. You're getting some good training in there, nurse. Some good training. Tell them how it is. When you're trying to cure the patient, don't do anything that might kill them. Thank you, nurse. Oh, boy. We got a nurse. Oh, hello. Why are you so sad? I need you to come and do this. Oh, this guy's got it. Yeah. Alright, why? You're hungry. Well, I wish I could build snack machines and drinks machines, but it won't let me. And I don't know why. Is there a cap on the amount of snacks and drinks machines I can have? See, I can't even... I just deleted one because I can't replace it. Hmm. I think the game might be bugging out in a weird sense. Unless it's something to do with these benches here. I'm just not going to touch anything, and I think I'm going to restart the game, because, yeah, I can't really. Ooh, we've just taken a look at a kiosk pew, yeah, apparently, uh, ooh, our rival. Interesting. We should be more like them. You need training, you need training. You'll get training soon enough, don't you worry. Chromotherapy, go home. Can't handle you. Where's our nurse? I think you are our nurse, aren't you? No? Maybe not? Hmm. Let me check our staff. Um, yeah, you're training. You're working in a ward. Okay, so I'm gonna move you. 
and I'm gonna pick you up. Gonna pick you up, thank you, and put you in here. And your nurse Hugo Woodwind. You are gonna work in here. There we go. We already have one Nigella in here, but you go work in there because you got diagnosis skills, so you can work in diagnosis rooms. Whereas you are PR pharmacy. Uh, promote three staff. Sure, let's try it. Mitten University is awarded us for training. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, that's litter, I see. Why is the game bagging out? It's the first sign of something horrible. Alright, I need to get some research training. So, research. You have to bring in a doctor. And train this junior doctor, I think. Does this actually require... Training units required 240. Huh, well, I'm gonna train this guy because once we've trained him, hopefully he can train others. Objectives. Oh, yeah, our staff, can we promote any? Doctor to research, please. Doctor to research. Uh, let's see. Currently taking a break. Hmm. Oh. Now you can be trained but not promoted. Yeah, it looks like we can't get onto any of that just yet. Alright, let me check. We've got. Yeah, we got a nurse in there. She's messing about. Why aren't we, uh. Why aren't you going? Oh, it's because Janitor's messing about. Messing about. Okay. Can upgrade that though while we wait. It must get weird for you. Hearing this voice coming out of nowhere. Uh, what else can we do? Minutes. But don't worry. I'm not inside your head. <laughs> I'm just inside your radio. Inside That's your where the soul. Lives too. Music like this. Ah. Okay. Alright, so now that um, repair has been done, we can hopefully eat away at this backlog. Chromotherapy, go home. My god. So we gotta remember that we're missing a drinks machine and we're missing a bin because it won't let me place anything in here. You can go right home. Goodbye. <laughs> He's like, oh, oh, I'm having a great day. Oh, no, I'm gone. You can go home. Nurse, please go to the pharmacy. Nurse, get to the pharmacy. Mm. Why are we suddenly lacking in terms of staff? Yeah, I know it requires chromotherapy. I'm trying my artist. We're gonna have one one person capable of it by the end of this episode by the looks of it. I feel mostly like he should actually just train two doctors in it as well. Just so we got the full three immediately. I might just hire those doctors now so that they can at least do a job while we wait. Lucille Delacreme. Get in there. Blah. Cold tea. Alright, so now I should be able to train in research using my own staff and get these student doctors that I've just hired to start learning it. And then I'll have three researchers. So if I go to the staff and their job listing, my research staff uh, should not be working in anything. 
Oh, except for you, because you're trained in it. Now, I've got to remember to assign these guys training. Oh, there's two promotions. We need two more. Oh, one more, sorry. Boop. Boop. One more promotion, please. So we got a backlog there because we're repairing. We got a backlog here because we had one beforehand from the upgrade, so. It's always important to realize why you've got a backlog. We don't actually really need to make a new one, although maybe it'll pay off if we do. Something to be aware of. We seem to be lacking plant watering. At least our doctors are helping. Yeah, useless janitor. I'm gonna hire a new janitor. I know it told me earlier that we didn't really have a good one, but it's literally the place is clogging up with trash and nobody seems to be doing anything. Can we on the job assignments? Yeah, we can actually um, designate the right people to do a job. So let's just say you don't do repairing or cleaning up rubbish, let's say. Extinguish fires. No, don't do that. Actually, you might as well because nobody, nothing's going to be on fire. Okay, so by restricting some of the jobs to people who can actually do it. So you're like mechanics too. So I'm going to say mechanics one people can't do it. This guy's going to be our, uh, this girl indeed, is going to be our repairman, or repair lady. Me lady. And we're going to get, you guys don't clean, but you do maintenance. And then I'm going to get a janitor, oh god, we got a dead dude. I'm going to get a new janitor. I think we need just one more. You. Staff assignments. You are going to be solely on restocking and refueling the plants. How about that? Hopefully that works out for us. I might train those janitors in their specific tasks then as well. It's a whole new level of uh, a serious incident. Ooh, chest infection. Uh, we need a clown clinic. Let's reject that. Can't train you just yet. Doo -doo. Right. So for the things that I can change, this needs to be more attractive. Everywhere else is just fine. This room is going to be filled out, and then I'll make that attractive, so that's fine. Oh, we got some poor health people. You're queuing at the front. You're queuing at, not quite at the front. You're now at the front. And you, you go after. You're dying because you're washing your hands and making a mess of things. All right, anyone else? Happiness. Everyone seems ecstatic except for this guy. This guy, he's weird. Staff are bursting with joy, good. Temperature needs a boost in this area here. So let's get a small radiator in this corner here if I can manage it. Yeah, all right. And I'll fill this area out as and when I need to because this just needs more areas. I can't build anything in there for some reason. Thirst, yeah, everyone needs a drink, but I can't build anything in there for some reason. But everyone in here is perfectly fine. Good. Hunger. Everyone in there needs something to eat, but I can't build anything in there for some reason. Staff energy seems mixed. Not a great deal I can do about that though. Hygiene. Mostly top tier. Mostly. Uh, the need for the toilet. Seems good. Maybe we can have a toilet in here, though, to fix that. Boredom. 
Yeah, we need more entertainment, more food and drinks in here, which is what this corridor was here for, but I'm not allowed to build in it. Solve that later. And maintenance seems like it's doing just fine. Okay. So we got most things covered. I think I'm going to leave it off here, guys, because as soon as I leave it off and jump back into the game, I should be able to build in here again if it is indeed a bug. So... That's going to be it for today. I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, then be sure to like, subscribe, hit that little bell icon, all that jazz. I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.